What's up, fabulous people? Welcome back to Triple P TV, the number one TV station for entertainment. If you are watching us outside Kenya, you can definitely tune in on Star Times Channel 430. And guys, happy new month. I mean, it's finally December and we are here for it. It's the festive season. This is the time we get to spend time with family. We get to share good memories. And of course, we get to eat. So I know it's a little bit chilly. It's raining. I hope wherever you are watching us from, you are warm and cozy. Because today, I am about to share with you some young talent. So Kama Kawaida, it's a girl, Bella Muziki, right here. You can definitely follow us on our social media platforms on Instagram at ppp underscore TV on Twitter ppp TV underscore ke make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel so guys today I am joined by okay it's she's the most beautiful girl I've seen I mean she's so young she's so talented and I just want to share her with you guys I mean she's so amazing beautiful outside and in and I want to have a candid conversation with her at Wambie like how did she start talent yake ali 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 akiwa na miaka ngapi I mean I've watched her songs on YouTube it's amazing that a girl so young can do such I mean when I was her age a connection ilikuwa najua so stay tuned because it's gonna be an interesting conversation. Mommy. Yes. How are you? I'm fine. You are looking beautiful. Do people tell you that you're you're pretty? Yes. Yes, so oh my god, I love the confidence. <laughs> yes. My god, you're so beautiful. Thank you. Karibu. Is this your first time like uh, doing an interview on TV? Yes. This is the first time? Yes. It's an honor to interview you here today. Asante sana for coming. So you are here with mom and dad? Yes. Okay, that's nice. So if you haven't noticed, Sijakupea introduction. Okay? Yeah. So there's a lot of people watching us from home. I want you to tell them your real names, what you do, how old you are. My name is Shanaria Evans. I am nine years old and I sing. Okay, you sure you're nine years old? No, not nine. Oh my god, <laughs> I'm ten. Yes, because I was talking to your mom backstage and she told me you're ten. So you're ten years old. Yes, when's your birthday? November 23rd. November, what did you do for your birthday? I did two birthdays. Oh wow, you're special, you're one. lucky. <laughs> okay, one, one in school, mm -hmm. and another one like in a in a, in a hotel somewhere uh -huh. to swim because uh -huh. I wanted to have fun. Uh -huh. That's nice. Who organized yeah. everything? Mom uh -huh. and dad. Wow. Shout out to you, mom and dad. I mean, it's amazing what you do for this young little girl. So you said your name is Shandariha Evans. Yes. This is actually the first time in Askia. Mr. Chanamrembo and it was Shanariha. I mean, that's a very special name. Between mom and dad, who gave you that name? I'm not sure. You're not sure? You've never asked? No. You, you really? I think after this, you should go ask mom or dad. Nanya ni nipea ijini Shanariha Evans. Because not so many people wana itwa ivo. Mi naskianga Beatrice. Have you heard of Beatrice? Yes. Have you heard of Bella? Yes. My name's Bella. And it's yes. very common. <laughs> anyway, Shanariha, so I want us to talk about your music mm. because uh, I was going through your YouTube channel and I really, really love what you do. Thank when did you. you start singing? Because you're so young, you're just 10 years old. When did you start singing? I started singing when I was three years old. I'm just watching some American Good Talent uh -huh. and I just start singing from there. Three years old. Mm -hmm. Wait, you guys, because me personally, I remember when I was three, I was still learning words. And you at three, you were already singing. Yes. Wow, that's amazing. So at this time, what was Koshule? Cindy, how do you juggle doing music? How do you balance that? So now at school, they love talent, mm -hmm. so we we borrow permission if I can come wherever I'm going, 
and they allow me because they love talent. That's why. Wow. Which school is that? Light Academy. Light Academy. Where is it? In Mombasa. Mombasa. So you came all the way from Mombasa? Yes. Wow. I mean, Mombasa must be proud of your girl because you are representing. When I become a mom, I definitely want to take my kid to a school where they appreciate talents because I'm really loving what uh, your mom and dad are doing. They're really supporting you. Cindy? Yeah. So what was your first song when you hit the studio? My first song, I actually did it in my music class. Okay. I just did it like, because my music teacher usually requires it usually records me when I'm singing, mm -hmm. so I didn't know it's going to be posted on YouTube. Wow. So it was in a class? Yeah. Wow. Okay. So, Ilukwini it Tuaje? It's Ride on a Rainbow. Ride on a Rainbow. That was the first song. When was this? Um, it was 2020 on February. Wow. Okay, you even keeping records. She knows the month. Okay, she knows it's 2020 on February. So after that, um, I've seen you have some Ama Piano song. Yeah. Is it the knees and toes? Yeah, that one. Okay. Maybe you could throw in uh, a few verses for us. Okay. Yeah. Shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. She ka kiu no, kiu no. Shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Yes, yes. Ki cha kiu no, kiu no. Wow, and I can see you also know how to dance. Yeah. You're definitely going to teach me because I've got two left legs so you could dance. That's what my mom used to say. About you? Yes. What do you mean? You're a good dancer. Does your mom know how to dance? I think so. I bet she doesn't. Maybe we should call her here. What do you think? Uh, okay. Uh huh. We should. But before we do, I was talking to you and you told me that it's your dad's birthday. Yes. Yes. And you told me that I shouldn't call him because he's camera shy. Yes. So how about we do something special for him? Do you want to sing like happy birthday for him? Since we can't call him here. Okay. Really? Can you do it? So yeah. just one verse, happy birthday song for daddy. Okay. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday dear daddy. Happy birthday to you. Wow, guys. I am just loving, loving this young girl. I mean, she's so talented. She's so bright. You can tell from how she's answering questions. So... Let's do this. I want to have her mom here so that we can talk more about her music and why she is really supportive. Because we know so much that parents out there have a support what we wow. Parents are sequizini and usule usome and it's just books and everything. When it comes to talent, not so many parents are ready to support. Okay, hi guys. My name is Zilpa and I'm Shanaria's mother. Yes. That's nice. Shorts? Short and sweet. Cindy, short, precise, and sweet. Short, precise, and sweet, yes. Yeah, so I just want to talk to you about your girl. I mean, she's so talented. Thank you. I mean, Yambia Alianza Kuimba when she was three years old. Yeah, she started singing when she was still very young. Yeah. Like, she would, she actually loves American Got Talent, the show. Uh -huh. So she would look at these young kids who, love, who go for the you know, to contest and yeah. they sing she, and she would like sing along them, just mm -hmm. copy them. Mm -hmm. And she'll come, hey, mommy, did you hear me sing? Like, yeah. we took her by his I'm like, okay. But now later on, when she was probably around five years, is actually when we started realizing that, oh, our voice is actually taking yes. a different route. Okay, yeah. and, that's uh, nice. Yeah. So later we enrolled her to a music school. Uh -huh. And especially this was during this time of COVID because when school was, was shut down, of course, kids were at home doing absolutely nothing, you know, just the boredom and everything. So we decided for her to start uh, like professional music classes. Yeah. So with that said and done, that is when actually her teacher, her, her music coach at that particular time discovered her and she was like, oh, your girl is really special, you know, yeah. like people should take this serious. Because uh, the music teacher has got even like that adults mm -hmm. in, the, in the particular 
academy. Okay. But uh, he really took a keen interest on her and was like, hey, maybe we try, we try something. And that's the first time she did her first original song, which is mm -hmm. called Dream Big. Dream it's Big. in YouTube. Yeah, we released it last year, mm -hmm. around November. Yeah. It's actually one year old. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then this year, just uh, October, we released a second mm -hmm. original song called Nizetos Ama Piano. Nizetos Ama yes. Piano. <laughs> yeah. So who helps her with the songwriting? Songwriting, we have a, we have a very talented uh, guy called Ochiko Troy. Okay. Yeah, he's really good at music writing. Okay. Also, the first song, uh, Dream Big, was uh, written by her voice teacher. Okay. Yeah, Mr. Philip Meiji. Wow, that's amazing! Yes. Amazing. Yeah. So just take me through, like, um, how is how is she at home? Oh, she's a very um, okay, my daughter is an extrovert. Yes. Like she's really out there. Uh -huh. <laughs> like, yeah, she's I can very, tell. She's very confident. And then she's got like a lot of friends. Actually, like a lot of kids in the essay really like her and like her vibe. Mm -hmm. She's a very outgoing person. She loves yeah. fun stuff, but mm -hmm. she also loves her music. Mm -hmm. She loves performing, stage performance. Yeah. And, you know, all these like artistic activities mm -hmm. really loves her. Yeah. So earlier on, I asked her how she manages to balance from uh, music and mm -hmm. school. Yeah. And you have been a, a very big part of her music journey. You've supported her so much. Yes. Like, how do you do it? Because so many parents out there, they're not for this. Okay, okay. it's not easy. Yeah. It's not an easy journey. Yeah. Uh, considering that she's a child, number one, she, and then she's in school. Mm. The lucky thing that she has is that the school that she goes to uh -huh. takes a very keen interest in talent. Yeah. So whenever, maybe like today, kids are in school. Yes. But she has this interview. Uh -huh. So they actually, we just ask for permission, they give her the break, then they send us assignments and lessons for the day. Yeah. Then of course, during at night, she has to catch up and do and submit her homework. That's how we balance. Uh -huh. But anyway, uh, God has been good. It's mm -hmm. been not so much of a difficult journey. Yeah. Yeah. So we try to balance it. Mm -hmm. School, she goes to school Monday to Friday, Saturdays okay. uh, is when she has her recordings. Okay. But even in, in between the week, mm -hmm. like Mondays, is it? Ma no, Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Fridays, mm -hmm. she has guitar lessons, she mm -hmm. has voice lessons. Yeah. But she only hits the studio over weekends. Okay. Yeah. So that's how we balance it. Yeah. Mommy. She's very cooperative, so it makes it easy. easy yeah. yeah. It's not easy, but mm -hmm. if you have a cooperative artist, then yeah. It, yeah, it's easy. I know even like adults, managing adults is very difficult yes. about because they've got so much. It's, it's more or less the same because they also have to go to work and, you exactly. know, but with her, she has to go to school. And school is a priority. School is number one. Yeah. But also we are taking a very keen interest does in her talent. Does she understand yeah. that? Yeah. She does. She does. School is number one. <laughs> <laughs> like that is not a debate in the house. Okay. <laughs> yes. Okay. Yeah. So, Mom, mm. uh, do you look up to any international artist musically? Yes. Mm -hmm. Who? I, I love Angelica Hale. Okay. I don't know who that is. So Angelica Hill mm -hmm. is one, actually that's, that's the reason why she started singing. Okay. American Got Talent. Uh -huh. I think she contested when she was four years old. Uh -huh. She's an international icon in the States. She's doing really amazing on YouTube and music are streaming. Mm -hmm. Angelica Hill is big, so she aspires to be like Angelica Hill because even wow. as she started young, yeah. Wow, I yeah. love like that. Congratulations. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. So are you like working towards uh, her maybe having a collab with any local artist or do you just want yes. her to do solo projects? No, no, no. We encourage collabs as well. If we get any offers, of course, and yeah. if it's something substantial, we have to jump in. We also have to be keen on the message. Exactly. And the type of music that she sings because she's a child yes yes so any collaborations prospective ones we are here and we are ready yeah reach out, reach out, reach out and we shall honor it yes. yes so for the fans who are watching right now and they will definitely want to reach out because we played her song mm -hmm. and i'm pretty sure so many people are loving mm -hmm. what she's doing mm -hmm. how will they reach out Okay, so she has a social media page. She has Facebook and she has Instagram. And on Instagram, her email address is there. However, still, you can just send an inbox on Instagram and just tell us that you want a collab and I'll share the, the WhatsApp number that we can, we can actually chat with uh -huh. and the email address where probably we can discuss more professional. Prof yeah. So where do you see her in like, let's say five years? In the next five years? Yeah. Who is the biggest star right now in Kenya? Let me see. <laughs> <laughs> let's, 
let's ask her. Uh -huh. Let's ask her. <laughs> Who do you think is the biggest artist right now in Kenya? Who would you love to work with? Nikita Keri. Oh, wow. Exactly. For oh, the next wow. five years, Nikita Kering's level. Well, I really hope she's watching <laughs> this. And if she's not, I hope her fans are watching this. Go tag Nikita Kering. Go on the comment section. Yes. Mwambe Nikita Kering. Collabo, please. Because this girl is so amazing. She's so talented. Yeah. Any parting shots, mommy? Maybe an advice to other parents who have kids out there. Uh, to parents who've got like talented kids, support your kid if you can. I know it's not easy, finances are involved, time is involved or anything, but when we start, when you say like we're building foundation for our children, even in education at home, talent is also another thing. We've seen kids who've gone places with their talent, be yeah. it be it like uh, football, you know, games yes. or just art. They even like uh, our local TV programs have got like serious young kids who are acting exactly. and it's really amazing and they're doing really great and they're winning, winning awards. Support your kid if you can, support it and you'll not regret. Exactly. Yes, you'll not regret. Yeah. yeah it's so a now that investment. we are winding up, I'd like to get final word from our princess here. Okay. Mami, yes. is there anything that you would want to tell your fans or your friends at home? Anything? I want to tell you, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. It's called Shanariha Evans. Uh -huh. yeah. yeah, and tell them to support you. Please support me. Yes. Kenya, support me, please. Exactly. Kenyans, <laughs> we've got a princess here. I mean, young girls are coming up and they're doing amazing in the music industry. There's nothing more we could ask for. I mean, exactly. we're so proud to be having people like Shanariha Evans over here. So, guys, that was it for the best exclusive interviews right here on Triple P TV. I was your girl, Bella Muziki. A big shout out to everyone who has been supporting us ever since the beginning. And we love you. We appreciate you. Thank you so much for supporting. Go to YouTube, watch her videos, subscribe to her channel, share and share and share her content. Until next time, let's meet same place, same time. Ciao. Peace. Peace.